Now the topic is diagnosis and treatment planning in orthodontics. If you see different questions, generalized anterior crossbite in the primary dentition indicates the answer is a developing class 3 malocclusion. And the second question, a child with a unilateral crossbite on closure is most probably suffering from and among the following bilateral construction of constriction of maxilla with deviated deviated closure into unilateral crossbite so it is the answer and if you see everted prominent lids with small mandible indicates the answer is decreased lower facial height and if you see the next question apatognathia means it is other name for open bite and overbite is defined as you know, it is a vertical gap, vertical overlap of maxillary anterior teeth over mandibular anterior teeth. The labiodental sounds are affected in class 3 malocclusion. And the next question, a steep mandibular plane angle correlates with? The answer is long anterior facial height dimensions and anterior open bite malocclusion. And the next question is, Skeletal deep bite will cause it causes downward rotation of maxilla and adenoids will lead to vertical descent of mandible and class 2 malocclusion usually presents which profile it is retrognathic profile 